Today we're taking a look at the Sony Digital Voice Recorder. If you're looking for the model number, it's the ICD-PX370. Comes with four um, gigs of internal storage. It does support a micro SD card, which shockingly is becoming a um, rare thing out there. So we're gonna do a little review of this and do a little unboxing right now and then I'll come back and show you how it works after I've tested it out. But let's just kind of take a look at what comes with it. Now, one of the things I get questions about is what storage on these kind of devices. It starts at 39 um, hours, excuse me, um, with it. And then it can go up to, depending on the quality, 159 hours. So I really wonder what that quality is on 159 hours on four gigs. Um, but again, if you need more, external um, micro SD card is there as an option. All right, so that is everything on the box. I just dropped the warranty card. Actually, that was the manual. Here's the limited warranty card, operating instructions set up down there. So put that aside for now. Okay. Clear a little room here. Let's pop this open and take a look what comes with it. And they really package this thing in there good. This is not gonna get damaged. So, so we can remove the little plastic cover. Um, it's not small, it's not crazy big, as you can see there, um, but it is a nice, easy to use um, size. Fits well in this palm of my hand right there with no issues. Uh, the layout of the buttons feel good. So ergonomically, this is nice. I definitely feel like this could go into my pocket without issues. It does have a spot at the top for a um, headphone jack, little center eighth inch there, microphone in, um, again, a center eighth inch connector right there, um, and then a mono mic right there if you wanna use it. Volume on the side, SD, micro SD memory card right here. Um, you can plug that in. Um, USB, so it does come with the ability to record this all and plug it into your laptop computer, export it to use later, which is pretty cool. Um, one of the things I got this model for, I know you can buy ones with internal um, rechargeable batteries. I still like getting the external ones um, just with, or I should say the regular batteries for this. So I don't have to worry about power going out. If I'm at CES, I'm recording a lot of stuff. I don't want to have to think, oh no, do I have enough battery to get through this interview, this conference. Um, I've had a older version of this uh, in the past. After about three years of tracking around, I sadly dropped and broke it. Got this new one here that um, is very similar to the old one I had, though it adds in the uh, USB right there. And um, it moves around little things. The hold and power is over here on the side and so on. So I'm gonna kind of test this out, come back and let you know what I think of it. My first impression though is I like a few things about it. I like how light it is. It's not the smallest one out there, but definitely feels small enough that I could drop this in my pants pocket. Uh, it won't take up a ton of room in my backpack. And um, yeah, so let's test this out. I'll be right back. All right, so I've been playing around with a little Sony recorder for a bit now, and a few things I'm really impressed. Sup, super easy, ability to add in the time, the date, all that fun stuff, free recordings. One of the things it does offer is the ability to stop those beeps. You can go in settings and turn them off. Um, it, your decision to use that is up to you how you want it, but it is nice that there is a silent op a recording option on this. Uh, recording is very simple, you just tap the recording. Give it a quick second because it does, you hear that little beep, there is a little tiny wait moment right there. And I always recommend when you're done to wait a second before you hit the stop to kind of allow a breathing moment there. So let's hit play. So it is a very nice recorder. Um, does a really good job on it. Quality of the recording is excellent. Mono sound with that single one. Of course, you can plug in an external microphone that may offer stereo so, and so on. One thing I'll remember, let me quickly do that. So you wanna get a good grip on this because if you're rolling your hands around in this or allowing a slide in your hand, the microphone will pick that up as most of these do. hear that sound, that's the sound of it when it's moving around in your hand. So just keep that in mind that when you're doing this, it needs to be firmly grasped in your hand to allow, prevent movement. Um, the volume um, up down here is a really nice place. The slider for the hold and power on the side fits right on my index finger when I hold this in my right hand. I'm sure I could flip that around where the um, 
the power everything is in my thumb and the volumes in my index finger. So that they actually did a really good job at this. If you're left-handed or right-handed, this is an excellent placement on that. Um, the options, everything you can you imagine, the clear voice, easy search, playback range, delete a file, protect the file, which is kind of cool. So if you get a important recording, you want to make sure you don't accidentally delete. That is right there. Um, and you can go, you can even divide clips, you can copy um, them. You can do all kinds of stuff right here on the device, even before you take it and use the USB to transfer it. Once you plug this into a computer, it just identifies it as an as a external storage device, much like a plug in an SD memory card in. And it just opens a window and you got all your recordings right there and um, just pull them right off. So questions, comments, let me know. But hey, a very basic, easy, affordable, uh, Sony digital voice recorder. Again, um, it's called the ICD PX370. Kind of wish they would come up with a cooler name than that. You know, if this was the Maverick recorder, I get a lot of people who come up when I'm using equipment like this and say, hey, what, what is that piece of equipment? I kind of been looking for a new one. Do you like it? It's kind of hard to say, well, go on the website and search for ICD PX370 um, and see if they remember that. As far as saying the Sony Digital Voice Recorder Maverick Edition or something. So pet peeve there, I kind of wish Sony would stop just giving these things random serial numbers. It would make it a little easier on people who want to recommend their products. But I'll link to this down in the show notes down there. If you want to buy this, you know, use our Amazon affiliate link. It really does help us with that. Questions, comments, let me know, and I'll do my best to answer them.